Although the coast of Alabama is well known for sun and sand, it has its dark side as well. So in this segment, we're going to explore the haunted places of the Gulf Coast, starting with Fort Morgan. Fort Morgan, a historic masonry star fort at the mouth of Mobile Bay, was started after the War of 1812 as part of an effort to strengthen the nation's seacoast defenses. Finished in 1834, the fort was widely regarded as the finest example of military architecture in the New World. Fort Morgan has seen action in the Civil War, World War I, and World War II, so it's no surprise that paranormal activity has been reported here. Footsteps, moving shadows, ghostly whisperings through this cavernous hallway, even full-body apparitions. Few of the tourists visiting the beaches around Fort Morgan realize that those sugar-white sands were once soaked in blood. From the forgotten souls of the slave labor that built the fort to the soldiers who lost their lives here, Fort Morgan's history is rife with battle, bloodshed, and misery. Visitors to the fort report seeing moving shadows in the dark recesses of silent rooms, disembodied voices of soldiers still fighting a losing battle, and prisoners still scratching at the walls of their cells. Some tourists have complained of hearing a man crying just after sunset near the barracks where a despondent prisoner hung himself in 1917. Nearby residents tell of eerie glowing lights and encounters with dark figures dressed in period clothing walking the beach and battlements after dark. Fort Morgan is a great place to take the family history buff or military man you can stand on the hallowed ground where soldiers fought and died. Close your eyes and you can almost hear the cannons and smell the acrid odor of gun smoke. But if you're there just after sunset, don't be surprised to hear the moans and cries of the wounded or find yourself face to face with the fallen. At Fort Morgan, history may just reach out.